the new SLK facelift type 171. Also here you can upgrade. In order to do this certain parts of the inside paneling must be removed and we'll show you how to remove the components of the center console. First disconnect the battery, unscrew the negative connection. Then we turn to the front part of the middle console. With a long wedge, loosen the gear shift cover and separate the electric connection. Now remove the safeguard of the gear shift. Should this prove difficult, use some pliers. When you've unlocked the parking lock, the gear shift can be brought into the neutral position. Then pull off the gear shift from the gear shift module to prevent any damage to the interior. Take off the cover in the middle console and loosen both connections. One connection is for the mirror and the other is for the roof. Begin now by removing the storage tray. When you've removed both rubber stoppers, you can unscrew the two fixing bolts. Now the storage tray can be taken out. We turn now to the Climatronic operating device. Quite simply slide this out and disconnect both connections. And the Climatronic can be removed. Proceed with the cup holder. Remove the two rubber stoppers and unscrew the fixing bolts underneath. And the cup holder can be removed. Afterwards, remove the upper operating field control device. Get access to the electrical connections and separate them. Next in line is the command. For this, four fixing bolts should be unscrewed. With the command, separate the five electric connections. When the connections are separated, remove the command. Therefore, the removal of the front part of the middle console is finished and we can then turn to the rear part. Open the lid of the storage box and unclip the holders with a suitable screwdriver. Remove the lid from the hinge. Next, take off the paneling above the rear storage box. Unscrew both fixing bolts. Now separate the connections. This only occurs, of course, in vehicles with sound systems, because then, here are two speakers. Now separate the electric connection between the seat armrest and unscrew the bolts of the console.
When the screws are removed, you can take out the console. Now unscrew the front screws of the middle console. The screws are here. Pull out the view protection screen of the parking brake and then the brake can be released. So that the vehicle doesn't roll, put the gear shift in park. Open the lid of the console. Here take off the screw cap and unscrew the fixing bolt. Unclip the light. There is only a light by the way with vehicles with a lighting package. Now the console can be removed by simply pulling it upwards and out. Here you can see better which screws must be loosened and which screws must be removed so that the console is more easily mounted. Lastly, all parts in overview.